Let me ask you the one question that everybody always has on their lips when they talk about Mick Foley. What the hell is wrong with you? <laughs> That's not the question I was expecting. That what is wrong with you? Why would you do Why? what you have done for so long to your body and to your face and to Jesus, man? What's wrong with you? Um, <laughs> psychologically, physically. Have you ever actually been psychologically evaluated for what you do? I mean, you got to have a sadist streak of some sort in you. No, no, I'm, I'm not. Nobody gets all right. No one gets into wrestling without some unresolved issues. Right. I mean, I needed total strangers to cheer for me, you know, while I engaged in a form of fantasy warfare. And you went above uh, and beyond yeah, did, what yeah. most people would do to try to elicit I was, attention. I was, uh, well, I, I thrived on the reactions, you know, and I loved it. Loved going places, getting those reactions. I, I wish I'd found out earlier rather than later that getting laughter could be as satisfying as making people wince or you know when i was younger i i, I, t I told the story at the hall of fame uh they, they only showed the edited version i said that i did a leap off my uh my bed onto a stuffed animal and uh back in the days of 1983 you either had that like if you wanted to uh videotape something or film it right you either had to have almost like a batman's uh type of belt Go utility belt full of batteries because each battery lasts about five minutes. Right. Or you had the eight millimeter camera, which needed a lot of light thrown into the room. So we were shooting with eight with an eight millimeter camera. And honestly, it was the first time that any females had flocked down to room three seventeen at Fitzgerald Hall in Cortland uh, to see what all the fuss was. And right. as I, right before I took off, I took a little swig of uh, red food coloring. Right. And as I hit the the leap on the stuffed animal, uh, I spat the mixture out. And I just remember vividly <laughs> one girl going, that's the most disgusting thing I've ever seen. And I just vividly remember thinking, I've got to get more of that, like, as soon as possible.